Hey everybody, welcome back to Control. Uh, so, we've had a lot of people asking to go and talk to the fridge guy for a long time. And I respect it. And we're gonna go talk to him. Relieve him of his duties, potentially. Maybe. He's on the fourth floor of the containment sector. At least that's where he was the last time we saw him staring at the fridge. So we had our first real taste of... Oh boy. I should have known. Is that it? Oh, apparently not. Apparently not. Okay, we gotta go through here. There's probably a way we could have, uh, taken one of these bad boys. But it's okay. Because it's nice to reacquaint ourselves with the inner workings of the old house. It's been a couple of days actually since I've played, so it's kind of it's a nice it's a nice refresher. Oh, yeah. I forgot about this guy. We've we've exhausted all of our options with him, I think. So here's the Panopticon. To get to the other floor. Start here. This is the second floor. <laughs> I'm pretty sure... I'm pretty sure that we may have even been able to take a thing right to that fourth floor, but... Third floor. Looking good. Looking good. Here we go. Don't worry, fridge guy. We're gonna be there. Oh, we have a thing for killing enemies in here. are going to die. <laughs> oh, hello. I'm a little rusty. Little rusty. That is not good. They go. I can get some healing. I'm actually legit surprised that I'm not dead. Are we cool? Now, do I need to be going... Hmm, I don't remember exactly where it's at. 
Twisted Passage. Is this what I want? I don't think so. I actually think this is taking me... I think that's where we met Dylan. I'll try the other side. Here we go. It was down one of these side sections, I'm pretty sure. Uh, here's the... Here's the one we could have come to. Okay. Fridge guy! Keep your eyes open. Keep them... <laughs> hey, Fridge guy. what can I do? Oh, you're back. Oh, thank you, thank you. If, if I look away, I don't know what this thing will do. You have to get me out of here. The door can only be opened by the Panopticon supervisor. That's Langston. If he's Are you around... serious? Langston. Yeah, I know him. I'll go ask him how to get you out. Please hurry. My eyes. They can't. Oh boy. They can't. Hey, calm down. Just focus. What's your name? Focus. Right. My, my, my name's Philip, and... I think I can hold on for a bit. It's just my eyes. My eyes hurt so much. Just hang on, Philip. Okay, Langston. We can do that. Okay, so we're gonna go... Panopticon entrance. I guess... This is close. Okay, well, that was really efficient. I don't think we've ever had a fast travel like that. <laughs> Where there's nothing loads? Weird. There's someone named Philip up in a cell. He's watching the refrigerator and very rapidly losing it. Philip? Oh, shit. I forgot about fridge duty. <laughs> He's been in there for over a day. I totally forgot. <laughs> You I forgot, forgot about, about fridge him? duty. There's a lot going on. The hiss, the Benikoff TV. Considering the number of things I'm juggling, ma'am, I think it's... Listen, it's fine. We just need to get him out of there. He said you'd be able to open the cell door. Yeah, I can unlock it on my terminal. There. Done. Door. Open. But Philip can't just leave. The fridge is behaving erratically. Ocular contact is the only thing that seems to placate it. If we don't have someone in there watching it 24-7, people will die. Well, you gotta rotate people then. I'll figure something out. I'm pretty good with these things. Oh, boy. <laughs> Being pretty good with altered items isn't standard bureau procedure, ma'am. He doesn't know us very well. <laughs> I'll see you later, Langston. I'll be here, like always. Good chat, Langers. Good chat. Okay, upper panopticon it is. So in here, it's like super fast. That's nice. Guess what, guy? Hello? Jesse? I'm back. I'm coming in. <laughs> thank you. Oh, thank you, thank you. Okay. Jesse? The friend is doing something. Employee incident. I gotta read about the employee incident, Philip. Incident in question occurred on Redacted and was brought to HR department's attention by the internal security personnel who intervened. According to the reports uh, supported by security camera footage, Agent Filson entered the staff kitchen with the intention of consuming his private meal, a homemade sandwich cut diagonally and packed in a plastic container, but discovered the refrigerator had redacted his meal. Agent Filson began to kick the bureau owned appliance as he expressed his frustration in a loud and profane manner. Oh, this is okay. Philip wrote this. Gotcha. No, wait. Oh, we're writing about him. This behavior caused multiple staff members present to become alarmed. Security was alerted. Philip complied, or Filson complied with security's commands to desist. Agent Filson was reprimanded and suspended for the remainder of the ongoing work week. The review committee recommends one non-mandatory <laughs> counseling session. One non-mandatory counseling session. Philip? 
find a way to subdue the refrigerator? If I look away, it hurts me. Okay. Yo, I don't know what we're doing. Are we? It sounds like the board, but I can't understand it. Fuck. What in the shit? What is this? Okay. What's with the just boss fights? Can I throw the thing that it's throwing back at it? Only one way to find out. Maybe. I don't know if we did it there. Whoa. I cannot. I cannot. My God. So, sure, back-to-back -back boss fights. I don't know how a fridge turned into this thing, but uh, it's gnarly. I'll say that. I wonder if I can shoot the things that it's throwing at me out of the, like, you know, out. If I can shoot them, that would be great. Hello? Jeff, Jesse? The fridge is doing something! Philip? Where did he... Ooh. I didn't realize that he was gone. If I look away... It hurts me. Okay, bring it. Oh, crap. It sounds like the board, but I... I can't understand it. What the fuck? Oh, yes. I can. Drop some health. Oh my god, I think that was lucky. Okay. there. Oh, what? <laughs> a 
Okay. Okay, so the floor is gonna fall out. Cool. That's gonna be sweet. The floor is gonna be gone. Uh... We have to- when it does the slam, we have to dodge, we can shoot the things. I feel like... I may have grabbed one? Maybe it's a distance thing? The is doing something. Do I have a better... Hmm. Maybe the pierce would be decent. Ammo cost while levitating. We already have a better one. Yeah, I'm gonna get an armor. I don't think that it has it. Philip? <gasps> if I look away, it hurts me. Third time's the charm, right? Sounds like the board, but I can't understand it. Fuck. So that's pretty close. Yeah, see, that's doing a ton of damage. Floors! The floors? This is gonna be this is actually gonna be really hard with no floors. Very difficult, sans floors, let me tell ya. But doable. The charge weapon, definitely nice. Hello? Jesse? The bridge is doing something! Philip? <gasps> if I look away, it hurts me. <laughs> this sounds like the board, but I... I can't understand it. Fuck? Open up. Open the eyeball! Holy shit, guys. 
Fourth time's the charm. There's no black pyramid here. Oh, please don't be a surprise. Oh, thank God. <laughs> Get me out. The fridge seems fixed. Did fighting that thing off change something? I mean, definitely seems so. Case files. Refrigerator procedures. An Arctic Queen brand electric refrigerator model from the 1960s. No cooling functionality. Doors decorated with crayon illustrations by Redacted. The illustrations cannot be removed from the item. All attempts have failed. The paper cannot be burned or torn. The item came to the Bureau's attention after it survived the collapse of New York City's Grand Central Hotel, where it serves as an appliance and apartment redacted, rented by a man named Redacted. It became the subject of local infamy after surviving the building's collapse undamaged. Mr. Redacted, who was out of the building at the time of collapse, Redacted PM, retained ownership of the item until 1974, when the Bureau purchased the item through a false identity. New altered effect has been observed. See file AI-10F for details. AI-10K for containment procedures. Okay. These, I think we've we've seen all of those logs, but this hotline is new. Specific, oh, former. The former descent is back. Knock on it is previous disappointment and is not part of the board slash us. We apologize, deny all knowledge for the inconvenience. Yes, you will see slash face the former. It is stealing, linking, altered items. It builds a competition slash not us. You must espionage slash destroy when possible slash inevitable. Do not believe slash get hyped about the former lies slash ads. We provide offer better bonus package and health plan. <laughs> if you leave, you will be sorry slash dead. And you will never work slash exist in this torn slash cosmic reality again. Yes. It's, I don't know, but it feels a, like a threat. A little bit. A little bit thready. No. Why listen to Langston? How'd it go? Where's Philip? Don't know. Philip's gone. Something happened before I could get him out. <sighs> poor Philip. God, poor Philip is right. I never did like fridge duty. <laughs> but if you're here, then who's watching the fridge? The fridge is fine now. I took care of it. You don't just take care of altered items. What did you do? I killed it. I touched it and wound up in the astral plane. This thing was in there. It was huge, had one big eye. Wasn't friendly. We've been getting reports from the astronauts lately about something fitting that description. The astral plane is usually connected to our world through objects of power, not altered items. If this thing is linking itself to altered items, then it's clearly powerful. This may happen again. Great. Do you think that thing is what got Philip? Must have been. The Panopticon is a dangerous place. The agents all know the risks. But Must have been. since you're some sort of altered item whisperer, I've got a list of others for you to corral. God damn it. The hiss are causing containment breaches left, right, and center. Here, start with these. I'll see if there are any others missing while you're gone. My life just got a whole lot easier. Did he mean to say that out loud? Okay. 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 I'll see you later, Langston. I'll be here. Like always. So that does give us a few abilities to play with here. Um, I wonder, do we just go and max these out, man? I kind of feel like that would be awesome. It's a neat thing down here for C's. I, I'm curious as to what that could unlock. Um, the energy is really nice. You know what? I'm taking the energy. Forget it. Okay, so 
let's see. We got headshot damage. It's not bad. Mission-wise, there's a bunch of stuff happening right now. So, the face of the enemy. Find the prime candidate program. Clear the mold. Eradicating mold growth around the medical wing. Mold removal here in these different areas. And then... Oh, Langston's Runaways seems kind of cool. Cleanse and contain the Japanese paper lantern, traffic light, hand chair, moving letters. So it's all in containment. Okay, so after tons of running around, not being able to find much of anything, I'm going to switch over to uh, eradicating the mold. There's still a whole bunch of locked areas there, so... It, there might be a few things that we can find, but um, I'll save you the the headache because I'm not exactly sure. Be with me. And see, even the even the medical wing is uh, looks like it's on a different. Here, maybe it's hold on. Ah, yes, yes, yes. Okay, so we need to eradicate mold, but we're also looking for, we're also looking for, which one is it? The hand chair. The hand chair. Okay. We can come in here now. That's cool. Level six door. This stuff doesn't kill us. Whoa, nice find. Okay. Where's my mold at? We've been through these areas, right? Gibson, male, age 28, returned from the astral plane approximately 13 minutes ago. This was his 21st child. Astral nut. Experiencing migraine-like pain, intense pressure behind the eyes, and partial blindness. He has no recollection of his time in the astral plane and appears severely disoriented. Preliminary examination revealed no immediate cause, so we will be sending the patient for x-rays and... He sounds... <laughs> It bursts right out of him. Great. Okay. This can go. This can go. I think this other stuff is fine. Pierce zoom boost. That's ju it's just an, a boost in the zoom we've tried. Doesn't really help. I'm not going to use the shots while levitating. Headshot damage, get rid of. Okay, so that loops us around there. Mold's gotten in here too? All right. Let's get cleaning, she said. Jesus.
Kill the bubble. Come on. What is that? We gotta take these things out faster. Is that all the mold? No. There's one more. Yeah, see, they regrow if we don't take them out fast enough. But it looks like there's maybe four of them or something. Or maybe they... Hmm. We're back in security. Where the hell's the other mold? Oh, is this the hand thing? Oh boy. Easy peasy. Okay. Well, we found the hand. Plastic seat shaped like a human hand from the 60s. Palm forms the seat with the fingers acting as the chair's back. Affects gravitational forces, attracting or repelling objects near itself with a force of redacted. Fingers have also been observed to change position, though too quickly to be witnessed or filmed. The item may be changing forms rather than moving. It was found in a warehouse in Albany. A team of ranger trainees, companies by experienced field agent, were dispatched to investigate local rumors when they encountered the item. Successfully retrieved the item. Okay. Hmm. But where's my mold at? Oh, this is open now. What? Huh. mechanical room, but this is just leading to security. What? I must go deeper on this other side. Unfortunately, no mold in here. I mean, you know, the kind we need. Am I missing something? <laughs> 
Something seems weird. I'm not exactly sure what's up with the mold situation because it was all in that area. Looks like it's all gone. Hmm. Well, we've definitely left our mark. That's for damn sure. Um, I think what we're going to do is we're going to head, we're going to keep on this track here. Um, we need to go to the Prime Candidate Program in the Containment Sector to discover the ugly truth about the Bureau. Which is off on that right side. Does that look like I need to get there through logistics? That section? I'm going to take a look. So we've been here, but I'm not sure where I need to go. It kind of looks like through there, but prime candidate. Is it maybe that where we saw that? If I go, like, we need to get here. So going in through these other sections, I feel like it doesn't help me. I'm not exactly sure where we need to go. Anyways, I might run around for a bit and try to figure out where we should go. Um, because I'm a little bit lost. But I'll try and figure it out. And then when I do, I'll bring you guys back in. Uh, thanks so much for watching. We'll see you soon. Bye.